Hey guys, it's Cana Grower. What's going on guys? We got an unboxing here from Best Buds. They're, uh, they're P1000. Let's break into this thing. Uh, they sent me this thing to check out. and uh, I actually ended up getting this light for free. And uh, check this. Alright, let's break into this thing. Alright guys. What we got? $30 gift card. That's pretty nice. Manual. Let's see what we got here. Let's pause that if you guys want to read any of that. Some specs for you guys. Decent spectrum, really. You know, usually you don't get much with much infrared light, you know. Alright, here's the manual, guys. Alright, guys, check this thing out. This is nice. I have, this is the first company I've ever seen to uh, toss in some protective covering for the corners. That's nice. Safety first, guys. You know, especially when it comes to shipping stuff you got money into. You know. Well, right, let's see what we got here. So we got our Samsung diodes. So it could be a 660 nanometers right here. The rest are 3,000 and 5,000 k. Alright, let's see what else we got. Let's check this thing out. Set this off to the side for right now. Alright, let's see what we got here. Regular cord. You know, your standard plug-in. Uh, it's kind of nice. Hang that outside your tent in case you don't have a timer. You can go turn it off and on without having to open your tent door. Be kind of handy if you had a if you're running CO2 and your tent sealed and didn't have a timer. I mean, ideally you just want a timer, but that's still handy though. I like it. All right, let's see what we got here. What's this? All right, this little card. All right. Looks like we got a regular hanging, hanging straps, guys. You know, so these got a little uh, lock and deal that connects to the lights. Looks like we got one ratchet strap. Fortunately, it's one with the plastic gears, but hopefully they'll add the metal ones on the other ones. Step up the game a little bit, but this guy's. This is pretty cool. I have not seen anybody uh, give out glasses yet with their lights. And I was actually needing a pair, so. You know. That's pretty handy. Boy, they are dark. Yes, they are. That should be good. Let's see if we got anything in here. Pretty sure that's it, guys. Box. Yep. Alright, let's take a look at this light now. And when it comes to these lights, I mean, as long as you get Samsung diodes, you're usually, you're pretty safe off, you know. This thing seems pretty good quality, so I would definitely recommend it so far. Let's see what we got here. Nice aluminum heat sink. The, uh, it's nice, nice and smooth. Off. Max that. She's got some weight to her, guys. Does not look like there are no RJ12 ports for remote controlling, but that's alright. Odds are, if you're just running a 100 watt LED, uh, 
might be out of your price range, but some places are building them in, but yeah, guys. Well, give me a second. We'll throw this in the tent and see what kind of numbers we get. All right, guys, we're back. Got her up in the tent now. Things looking nice. You know, we got our Apogee MQ500 right here. And uh, I just got her dimmed down all the way. We're at two feet. Turn this thing up, see what we got. Two feet in the center. Looks like we're rocking. Let's see. 30. Let's see what it's like with this door closed. Alright, closed doors, guys. That's about where you're going to be. About 400 at two feet. It's enough to flower with. Uh, for sure. I mean, you're not going to get giant hard nugs, you know. But it'll get you there. Let's see where we're at. Now. Two feet. Let's see off this side. this around a little bit check out the corners this definitely be a great veg light all right let's lower it down let's lower it down to 18 guys all right guys here we are at 18 18 inches. Let's see what we got here. You gonna rock about 500. See, that, that, that's about where you need to be. Let's start getting some solid flowers. About 500, you know. Really not too bad, you know, for 100 watts, you know. All right, let's bring her down to 12. All right, guys, here we are at a foot. Kind of had to rearrange the light cord. I got, I just had this tent pulled out just for a test, and all of my regular sockets are taken up, so I just, just kind of got this sitting wherever, you know, and it's, it could be closer to a socket, let me see. second guys all right guys had to get it resituated but uh we're getting now all right we got 12 inches let's see what we got and about 800 so that'll be nice 667 on that side 630 on that side Corner of the fixture running about 575, 560, let's see what we're doing. 650 on the corners of the fixture, it looks like. About 800 in the center, guys. That's about where I would run this. Yeah, about 12 inches. You know, start at about maybe 14 to 16. And, uh, you'll definitely get some good flowers out of this. Um, more good for a 2x2. Two two. Wouldn't recommend anything larger, but not for this light. Not myself, anyways, but, uh. You definitely can get her higher, for sure. You'll drop her down to about 10. Maybe 11, give you right at 1,000. You know, 850 on the sides. If you want to go up to 10 inches, 
supplement with some CO2. You're good to do that. For sure. Alright guys, stay tuned. We got a... Uh, should have one of their P4000s coming in the test. And I will also have a... Uh, I got a TS1000 I need to do an unboxing. And we'll do an unboxing part test video on that soon. So stay tuned guys. I got some more lights coming in. I got a... Uh, a couple different ones from Vipar Spectra. I got the TS1000. Just finished this one. I'll be have uh, another one of these best with P4000 coming in. And uh, better stay tuned, guys. We got a lot of good stuff coming on. Oh, by the way, doing this in the Mars Hydro tent. You know, I've got to say this thing is is a lot nicer than the Vivo Sun, hands down. Like not even really a competition. I mean, this thing's at least. Feels like it's about thir three times thicker. I know they, this is about 1650D, where the VUO Sun's about 600, and you can you can tell for sure, for sure, guys. But uh, if y'all need a, a little light for a two by two by two, check these guys out. Best of P1000 is what this picture is, and uh, I'm pretty happy with it. All right, stay tuned for more, guys. See ya.